Hey guys, Dominic here, and you need to work on those hips that feel a bit stiff, so here's what you should be doing. So let's start you off in a simple dog up, dog down. Make sure your hands are way behind the shoulders and the dog up. Then it's dog down and give the calves a bit of a going over here just to give them a quick pass over while you're at it. Lunge the outside of that right hand, bend that front right knee, and the back leg should be straight. My uh, heel is on the floor there, and try and lunge into that as much as you can. Get a little bit of uh, hip flexors on that backside then as well. And then from there, we're gonna bring the hands down towards the floor and then lower and then try and get a bit of t-spine rotation here also with that we get your adductors and your hamstrings uh, going there as well so in each of the poses try and hold breaths uh, and positions for five breaths i should say so any of the ones i stop on here i'm kind of flashing through them but basically hold each one for about five long breaths which could be 20 30 seconds so hitting the quads here now and you'll notice each pose will move smoothly into the next one so just push the standing then then we're going to sit back into it work on those hamstrings and uh, that'll give it a nice stretch into the hamstrings keep the back straight and think about bringing the belly down not the shoulders down in that position and then whip that leg back and then go into a quick pigeon stretch right after that so again everything will flow neatly from one pose to the next you'll then go back to dog down position get a bit of hamstrings and calves going there again which all links up obviously into the hips and then from there, we'll just do a quick dog up, dog down, and then you're off to the other side. So a couple of ideas there. It'll flow neatly from pose to pose.